What's going on guys? This is Brian with Tennessee Rocks. Just heading back to the car. We uh, came out to the creek to get some more uh, material for the tumbler. And, uh, but today on this episode, we're finally gonna show you guys the results to all our hard work tumbling those uh, agatized and fossilized brachiopods. So stick around, we'll check it out, see ya. Well, we made it back to the house. So I've got these rocks, they're set up on the table here and uh, pretty excited about being able to show you guys. Uh, it's been a long road tumbling these guys. Uh, got about 111 days invested tumble time. Uh, now, not all the rocks have been tumbled for that entirety of time. Um, but uh, yeah, it's been, a, it's been interesting. It's my first tumble. Um, uh, at least of these uh, agatized brachiopods. And uh, so what we're gonna do today is I'm gonna show you guys some of, uh, I picked out some favorites and I'm gonna show you guys these. And I've got a slideshow at the end of, at the, end of the video. So make sure you uh, stick around to the end and see that slideshow. Cause what we're gonna do is we're gonna look at some of these rocks through a microscope. Uh, these rocks are pretty uh, spectacular to look at uh, with the unaided eye, but uh, the microscope really brings out some interesting features. And the, uh, the slideshow should showcase those features fairly well. So let's jump right in it. Let's show you guys some of these rocks. This is one of my favorites. It's just... Um, it's really nice it's only got a little crack on the back side but uh this is one of my favorites i'll just go through them and uh let you guys see them i'll try to run through them fairly fast because we do have quite a few And you can see some of them still have these pits. Um, that's just kind of the nature of these rocks. They, uh, they have uh, agatized uh, brachiopods on the inside. It's like a seashell. And so there's a lot of pits and uh, voids that uh, get filled with agate and some don't. And so they, they can be kind of a pain to tumble out. But I kind of knew that going into it. So I wasn't really looking for perfection on that front. This is one of my favorites here. This is a good one. You can see all the pockets of agate. And it's got some uh, bryozone right there. You'll see a cool picture of that through the microscope. It's really neat. It's a little windy out here today, so if you hear uh, some wind coming through the microphone, I apologize. I don't have good enough lighting to do this in, in the house yet. I'll try to slow down. This one is really cool underneath the microscope. So uh, I don't know if I'll get through all these rocks. This is an eight one here.
I like this one. It's also really cool. See those little pockets of bag it there. It's really hard to tell uh, what the agate looks like. Believe it or not, there's a lot of banding in some of these agate pockets, but you won't see that till the slideshow when we look through the microscope. But uh, that's where I think these rocks really shine. I think they're through the microscope there. They're really cool to look at. You could take a rock like this and uh, you could spend 30 minutes to an hour, it seems like, just exploring it underneath the microscope. So a lot of neat features. I'll do a couple more. Like I said, I think the main uh, interest is... Uh, what you can see through the microscope. It's one of the main reasons that I was so uh, fascinated with the this type of uh, this rock being the, uh, the agatized fossilized brachiopods. I was once I looked at them through a microscope, I was kind of blown away, pretty shocked. This one is really cool. But it's been a great joy picking up this stuff, and uh, I haven't heard a lot of people talk about um, this type of material or even the brachiopods being agatized, um, especially locally. I, honestly, I was kind of shocked that something like this could be found in my local area. I just uh, kind of fell in love with it. so. Definitely one of my favorite things to pick up out of the creek. Now I know you guys have been seeing me pick this stuff up for a while now, wondering what, what I was doing with it. And uh, this has been a long project. I'm just now getting to where I can show you guys. So it's pretty exciting. So uh, what we'll do is, uh, in just a second, we'll go ahead and uh, start the slideshow. and. And uh, let you guys take a trip through the microscope. See you guys on the other side.
hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, we're going to continue picking up the uh, agatized brachiopods, uh, material from the creeks, especially as we're hunting for artifacts and geodes and other things. And I'd like to continue tumbling them. So if you guys like seeing more of that, um, just leave a comment below, let us know. Also, if you enjoyed the video, give us a thumbs up. That really helps the channel out. Uh, if you've got any questions, also leave a comment. Uh, we'd love to hear from you guys. But uh, I guess until next time, we'll see you on the creek. Hey guys, I guess the video is over. Thank y'all so much for uh, uh, something. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> How do you do it, Tom Cruise? Well, I guess the video is over. Yeah, it's over, all right, you big dummy. <laughs>